Dell Tech World is this week, and we wanted to take a closer look at some of the stories that are coming out of it, because of course, it is a massive undertaking for people in the enterprise computing space. And there's a lot of news, and we're covering a lot of it, not only here on The Rundown, but also through uh, 6.5 Live and a lot of the other Futurum Group uh, properties. We have a lot of people on site that are talking about it. Uh, the first thing, Stephen, we would be remiss if we didn't mention the fact that NVIDIA, which is quickly becoming one of the most valuable companies in the entire world, in the history of the world, is there. And they're talking about using Dell AI Factory and NVIDIA together for AI adoption. So how do you see this becoming something that Dell can take the NVIDIA ball and run with it? Well, it's interesting because if you look at what most of the expenditures so far on NVIDIA hardware related to AI have been, most of them have bypassed not just the traditional uh, OEMs like your Dell or HP, but even uh, some of the more um, aggressive um, and, and, and manufacturers like Supermicro. That being said, uh, these traditional um, server and, and data center OEMs are expecting and indeed already reaping um, many, uh, you know, increased uh, sale of uh, devices from uh, NVIDIA in order to build out AI. So let's start with this AI factory concept. Um, so uh, Jensen Huang was uh, on stage at Dell Tech World. Um, of course, it seems like Jensen's everywhere. Uh, I hope he gets that jacket cleaned sometimes. Um, and, and he uh, was talking about this idea that an AI factory, well, this is not like an IoT in, uh, factory or a factory that uses AI. No, the AI factory concept is that it is a metaphorical factory that manufactures intelligence, not products. And that that factory is built on, of course, NVIDIA and other uh, hardware. And that's really what uh, Dell is talking about here. Essentially, the Dell AI factory would uh, leverage NVIDIA's incredible uh, GPUs uh, with their Tensor cores, um, their Spectrum X Ethernet networking fabric, their Bluefield DPUs, and would enable enterprises to build their own AI factory that manufactures intelligence. Um, many of us are a little skeptical about the quality of the intelligence that's going to come out of these factories, at least initially. But I think that the uh, power that generative AI has makes it inevitable that eventually we're going to have a whole new wave of uh, industry uh, producing intelligence using uh, AI. And I think that that's the bet that Dell is taking here. So essentially, Dell is putting together uh, a integrated offering that's not just a server with a GPU in it or something, but no, it's a complete integrated stack that includes Dell's PowerEdge servers, as well as NVIDIA's Blackwell GPUs and uh, DPUs and all of this in order to manufacture, well, something. But again, uh, this is kind of like a company that makes, I don't know, CNC machines or industrial presses or something. Just having a CNC machine doesn't mean that you're going to produce something useful. It, you know, the ball's in the court of the customers now who have to go out there and actually use this AI factory to make something productive. 